that it is only through development that people, the differences between income, the income disparity can be bridged. Unless that kind of a spread is given for development, that kind of uh, resources are shared for every such developmental activity, the disparity between haves and have-nots will, ne will never ever get bridged. And for a state like Jammu and Kashmir, development is something which has been in the wings for a long time. It has never happened. You'd see some development here and there, but the consistent pace at which infrastructure was required, basic materials which is important for living and also for building economy, such as electricity. I was talking with the governor even as we were coming here. The capacity, the potential capacity that JNK has is about 20,000 megawatts. Imagine what a state which can produce that kind of power can do for itself and for using it as a product. If you as JNK are able to produce that much, you are able to uh, sell it to the rest of the country and also with that money be able to do a lot more for our own people. However, that capacity has never been fully exploited. And as a result, the pot potential exists but the power generation not coming up over the years has denied JNK its own developmental goals without basic supplies of electricity for a beautiful state like this, for a potential ridden state like this, development has always been at its bare minimum. So when the Prime Minister's goal or that guiding principle is Sapka Saad, Sapka Vikas, Sabka Vishwas and Sabka Prayas, you have all the Prayas, you have all the Vishwas, but if you don't have the required endowments for it, development is not going to be achieved as much as we want. And that is where it is important now for JNK, post the abrogation of the 70s, to get that which has been denied to the common Kashmiri citizens, the facilities, the development, and therefore make all his aspirations come true. There is no point if it is kept like a small oligarchy of people. Our holding every resource and denying the ordinary citizen. And that is where you find ordinary citizen today when democracy is allowed its full play, participation in electoral sources. You find them have happily, actively engaging in spite of calls which tell them, no, you can't. Because the people want to grow. Their aspirations are there to be realized. And that is nothing unusual for a common citizen. It is a common aspiration. Every citizen should have to be given a space. And that's what is being given post the abrogation of 370. And in that, we cannot afford to have any delay. I would therefore, in fact, say the more active engagement that the two boards undertake, and here I would like to inform through the media and through all the invited guests, there are about 250 principal commissioners of income tax all over the country. In the northwest region alone, under which comes this area, there are about 20 principal commissioners of income tax. This shall be the 21st, and therefore, all over the country, this shall be the 251st Principal Commissioner of Income Tax. And for which, I'm glad to hear from the Director, from the Chairman, CBHDT, that an officer with good experience in Mumbai is now brought in here. For all the experience and for all the exposure that officer can bring to this region, I expect there will be greater information about what paperless income tax filing can be like, what settlements can be made, what kind of, uh, for those who are already taxpayers, what kind of facilities are provided, what kind of technology-driven facilitation happens so you don't need to visit the office at all, you can do it from your home. So at this stage of India's development, for 
the income tax to first have for the first time in this region which is now upgraded to become a principal commissioner so often a permanent own building of course we know the tragedy of 2005 when the building could not survive an attack but i'm grateful to the people of cnk for today enabling a permanent own building for the income tax which i'm very honored to come and serve here to inaugurate and be with you all in this context it is now for all of us to work together to serve the people of kashmir to make sure that development reaches them the importance of collecting legitimate tax is understood and also a transparent process through which we can explain how that money gets spent um on the details of how much is collected what is spent i will definitely distribute both in english and hindi through the media and also through the uh, visitors who have come here the details of all that is getting spent but one data which uh, the honorable lieutenant governor uh, chatted about i would like to share uh, on the the jnk development funds which have been given post the abrogation of 370 sorry even because okay. i'll uh, probably list out the kind of uh, projects which got completed at the pmpp and uh, that itself will probably expand on how much has been spent before i read out those uh, projects completed i'd like to tell you that the concessional rates of gst apply for quite a few of those items which are unique to jnk carved wood products artwork decorative articles of wood barrel and so on have a favorable gst rate wooden frames for painting photographs mirrors etc also have a favorable rate statues and ornaments of wood wood marquetry inlaid and jewelry box box wooden lathe lacquer work again given discounted rate articles of paper mache do also have a discounted rate of gst handmade carpets and other handmade textile floor coverings also get a concessional rate hand paintings drawings and pastels including basholi paintings also get a good rate at the gst now the projects which have been completed by the pradhan mantri development program which has been given to jnk are about 21 it's important that we list it out so you know the kind of income generating activities which are happening the patote kishtavar simpan pass road has been completed under the pmdp jammu udampur road again completed under pmdp chennai nashri tunnel completed interest subvention scheme implemented uh, eap externally aided projects jnk us dip also undertaken counterpart funding eap also happening assist assistance for damaged houses also given under pm dp pok and cham dps displaced people uh, uh, assistance which has been extended have also been completed under the pm dp jammu migrants have also been completed Rem, rem remuneration for the spo also undertaken jn nurm projects also undertaken and completed srinagar uh, banihal uh, road kag khasi gun banihal tunnel permanent restoration for some part uh, five irp battalions jhelum phase 1 swachh bharat abhiyan solar off grid system uh, bb cant kalai bridge and some more in that category uh, and uh, the sgr uri loc road 
completed and PMRP and TV network work have also been completed. So, in a way, what I want to underline is 40,000 people were killed due to terrorism over the years. A land which is otherwise very peaceful, beautiful, had spent so many years in this very heart crushing, tragic phase of development. Now, post abrogation of 370, the DW Commission has also been instituted. DDC polls have shown that the people are looking forward for aspirational meeting of their dreams. And therefore, I would want to tell you in the context of dedicating this building, LG uh, Honorable Manoj Sinaji was right in saying the building dedication is only a limiter. It is only a guise. It is only in that bahana that I am doing this. But the larger issue is reaching out to every person in Jammu and Kashmir giving his due or her due to the person. The development which has been denied for the last 70 years should now be reaching every citizen of the state. And that is where we are here. So thank you for giving me this opportunity. And I hope the officials here, both of the CBDT and the CBIC, will do their maximum best to reach out to the people and help them to understand how best services can be rendered by you. That will be a very important step in bringing development to people of GMC. Thank you very much. Jai Hind. Subscribe to our channel by clicking the subscribe button. Click the bell button and enjoy the latest uploads from our channel.